this time, folks, I present to you a sequel in which we kind of have heard of and yet we kind of not heard of. And, of course, it's brought to us by S&K of 1993. This is Sengoku Two. And believe it or not, it's about the same as the first one, except that. We can somehow play as three new characters as compared to the last two characters we had in the last in the last game. Like I said, if you actually like Sengoku Densho two or the Sengoku series, well, it's worth playing. And of course, I played this before because I played this during my free time. Yeah, we can actually play horseback. And as you can see, we have different moves. Sometime in the far future. I come from the past to help, to ask for your help. Please come with me. We shall take history and time back from the evil monarch. And that evil monarch happened to me. Bring these men to help. And we have just reached a time and a place now. For we just reached the barbarian age. And what the hell? Now, unlike the last game in which... You mainly had to do a lot of slashing here. It's not that much. Just one slash, everybody falls. Come on. And the people are running. Because of Kojira! And the crow and the crows are flying because we are going into another area. And just like last time, we do get power ups. And our sword can actually become a Hadouken. Yes, blood isn't spilt. It's being, well, it's just not being spilt.
And just like in the last game, you can change forms. Tenokin! Oh, yeah. I love the electric sword. Uh huh. Well, I wish Samurai Showdown was that damn simple, like here. But no, it had to be. It had to be a, a fighter. Well, I suppose this is our first boss, so. Let's switch to Ninja! Well, we've taken down the... We've taken down the Ninja and her... Giant. You can't clash. Yeah, it's just like Samurai Warriors, except... You can do different moves other than this. Well, it is a Barbarian era after all. But then again, I have to ask a question. Um, what does Japan have to do with the Chinese era? Oh, wait, never mind. Looks like I'm riding on snake whales and count your blessings that I beat you. Yeah, sure. This boss is pretty easy. All he does is jump around. So every time you take a good slash at him, he'll fall. And then he'll split into this form. Now, yeah, it, it reminds me of the final boss in the first game. But then again, he's an idiot. So our next area will be 1940X. 1940X, ladies and gentlemen. Nobunaga is sending us to the World Wars. <laughs> Let nobody interfere with me. Ha 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 ha. Yep, we're in World War Two. We are totally messing up history right now. We are messing with history so badly now.
We have totally, we are totally fucking up history. We are messing with history so badly now. It's like for the most part, I don't really need change forms. But then again, let's change into Tenguman! Yes, as Tengu Man, we actually smack people around like the bitches they is. I personally like Tango Man, even though he's called Old Man. I prefer calling him Tengu Man. And the good thing is that our character can just change back to normal after which. Seems like we're on the river sticks all of a sudden. Wait, how did we get here? Well, we don't need that. We paid our toll, bitch. We don't need no freaking toll. This is my toll. My soul will be my toll, bitch. So yes, we are murdering everyone who was in 1940X. And this time we will change into Okami! And this time the Okami can actually do a much better job and he looks so techno. Yeah, behold, you're getting your ass kicked by a dog. Or rather, a wolf. You're getting your ass kicked by Shadow Dancer. Really, I'm fighting Brocken? Really? Change. Yeah, that's the one thing that I really did do like about this game. The horseback scene is pretty damn awesome. You really can't change on this mode, so all you have to do is just basically just lop off some heads. Oh look, it's the Red Skull! So does that mean Ghost Pilots are going to make a cameo appearance in this game? Because if they are, that's going to be pretty awesome.
Oh, yes, everybody will be cut tonight. Today. Didn't I already deal with you before? You cheap little bastard. Oh yeah, please, do a sword dance for me. And die for my amusement. Dino Dinshin! You shall be split, sir. It's amazing how well you can actually do without little work of doing so. Oh, no. No. Excuse me. They must be the ghost pilots. Oh. Kind of makes me curious if there's a blood code in, in this one. Really, guys, don't you guys know any be better? Never mind. Who are you? No one returns once they've stepped into this world. Go, Yafusa! She must be an Omiyoji. Uh, you must be that nine-tailed fox everybody was talking about. You must be a QB. Because you certainly look like a QB. Idiot! You know, for a QB, you're pretty damn hot. And that's saying a lot, you know. Ninja Paw! I know, that was shameful, but no, it wasn't. Now our next area is the 1990s. Who knew Nobunaga could... You've tangled with me! I will definitely kill you! In the age of our peoples. As I said before, who knew Nobunaga could tamper with time and space like that?
Ow. Uh, that's one thing I just don't like. It lags a bit whenever I record. You know what? I am Tangleman! Unless you want to get popped one, stay the fuck back. Told you I'm Tangle Man! I will blow you away! Seriously. Look, man, I know Thor. And that's the good thing about this game, which I really do like. Turbo Burner. <laughs> Okay, you know what? That's gone too far, man. When you turn Buddha into a demon... Something has to go down. I'm sorry. And as more emails pop up, all I'm going to say is, let them... Probably about Action 52 or some shit. I don't know. Hi there. Nipple. Really, you're bringing out the Mongols now? Now, see, I can go for kill or just straight all out disable. <laughs> Tangleman. As Tangleman, I can actually just literally beat the living shit out of somebody. If I wanted to. That's why I switch forms every so often. Just for the time. You're gonna mess with Hooligan Tango like that? 
Something is wrong with you, sir. Bitches, please. Now, see, that's what people are supposed to do in a situation like that. Run for your lives. I'm probably going somewhere, aren't I? Now, how do I know about this? I play Samurai Warriors. What else? Now, everybody, run for cover. <laughs> Bodies are going to get thrown like nobody's business. Ouch. It's amazing what goes on in the 1990s. I know there's a bank somewhere. Did I want to make a deposit? You always want to make your deposit somewhere. Let her go. Back up. Gotcha. Hello. Yo, Chisune. Well, I was thinking of somebody else. <laughs> I was thinking. Yes, I was thinking of Yoshimitsu, not Yoshisune. Dude, if you're going to use a canoe... To get from one place to the other. <coughs> then something is definitely wrong with you. Man, get Gilgamesh on the horns, man. Walter Dragon, give me your power! And you're sending flying fish after me. You have shamed me and shamed yourself, but you have mainly shamed yourself. I don't want to see you again. I will kill you myself. 
Bring him here! All right, let's do this. The final battle at the Demon Castle. So actually, we're here at what seemed to be Nobunaga's residence. At the module. This is such a good game, I don't see why it's not on Virtual Console. Or even on, or even in Xbox Arcade. But I swear, this would be awesome to play on either console. And yes, I do plan on getting an Xbox for myself. So I mentioned this before, but I also have an account. Well, a gamer tag, but anyway. And as you can see, I don't really rely on my spirit partners that much. That's why I stay in this form most of the time. Oh, look at that. I'm facing Magikarp. How very unusual that I'm facing Magikarp. Oh, and you're not a Gyarados? Throw him back. Yeah, gotta throw him back. He was no good. Look, man. If it's going to be like that, man. I'll just have to pierce through that defense of yours, man. Bitches heal. That's how it is going to be. I will beat you down with the power of Wolf. Even though I know it's a dog, I'd rather call it a wolf. You and your kick eye, really. Like I said, you only get sixty seconds per turn you change, so that's why, for the most part, that's why I change very frequently.
You now face the power of Tenguman! Get back, you kaiju. Back, I say! Nippoo! <sighs> now I will send my hooligans after you. Abone! Abone! My son the cow shall take care of you. And yes, I shall bring forth the lightning. Switch back. You still disappoint me. Stop it. Many people shall remember this day as the day I whipped your ass. Yeah, play that drum, man. Heads are gonna roll, man. Oh no, Benaga, are you done yet? Now, considering that this game is somewhat pretty long considering it has four levels the length of the game itself really does say a lot cuz it looked like i've been playing for 40 minutes Of course, I could be wrong. Rocking you again. 
No one can stop our scheme. Now, if you don't mind, sir. You've got to be kidding. Don't stand in my way! You look like Nobunaga. All right, there, Genghis Khan. No, you had to be Nobunaga 20XXXXXX. I won't die until I have it all. Oh, great, I'm facing Orochi now. But the good thing about Tengu Man is he got some range with his attacks. Especially the fact that he's the best, he got the best range in the game. Mitz. So with that, the game's over once again, and I'm going to put in my initials. And once again, the evil Orochi is destroyed along with Nobunaga's ambition. Thank you, warriors. We appreciate your bravery. Go back to your world. And after all that, the Time Ninja, Tengu Man, and Time Okami leave us again. The Sovereign of Darkness tried to change history. His attempt ended in failure. The battle in another world also ended in defeat. Remember, there is always evil when goodness exists. So that's it. That was Sengoku Densho 2, a.k.a. Sengoku 2. And I have to say, for being two years later, that was pretty awesome. I truly recommend it to those who really want to get into this kind of this kind of arcade game. Really, it's worth playing, and probably worth LPing. So this is the Tenkaichi of Gaming signing off for now, and I will say this: stay tuned for our next exciting Let's Play when. We go into the final part of this game, namely Sengoku 3.
see you then.